the creation of a race. Race, as we understand it, is a fairly recent social phenomenon, driven more by politics and economics than by science. There is, in fact, but one race, human, and all branches thereof stems from an African genesis, a black Eve. But politics, which follows a different drummer, has ever created and nourished social difference and social distinction. When we speak of Hispanics today, do we really know of which we speak? The term was not in wide use until fairly recently, until the latter years of the 20th century, in fact. The late renowned black historian Manning Marable, in his 2002 work, The Great Wells of Democracy, wrote, In 1971, the U.S. Census Bureau invented the category Hispanic. The term was imposed on a population of 16 million people, reflecting divergent and even contradictory racialized ethnicities, cultural traditions, and political loyalties. Black Panamanians of Jamaican or Trinidadian descent who speak Spanish, Argentinians of Italian or German descent, anti-Castro white upper-class Cubans in Miami's Dade County, impoverished Mexican-American farm workers in California's Central Valley, and black Dominican service and blue-collar workers in New York City's Washington Heights. Yet when states or hierarchies name the other, the act of naming creates its own materiality for the oppressed. Government resources, economic empowerment, and affirmative action scholarships are in part determined by who is classified as Hispanic and who is not. If Hispanics are Hispanics because they speak Spanish, are we Anglos because we speak English? Arbitrary divisions made by politicians and practiced long enough, it becomes reality. From Imprisoned Nation, this is Mumia Abu Jamal. These commentaries are recorded by Noel Hanrahan of Prison Radio.